On October 28, 2024, Croatia and Germany took significant steps to bolster their defense capabilities by signing a letter of intent in Berlin. This landmark agreement marks the commencement of negotiations for Croatia's acquisition of 50 Leopard 2A8 main battle tanks, recognized as one of the most advanced models in the esteemed Leopard series. The agreement, facilitated by Croatian Defense Minister Ivan Anuzic and German Defense Minister Boris Pistorius, sets the stage for a major modernization of the Croatian military's armored fleet. The Leopard 2A8, developed in Germany, is celebrated for its impressive combination of firepower, protection, and mobility on the battlefield. Armed with a 120mm L55 smoothbore gun, the tank is capable of engaging a diverse range of targets at long distances with exceptional precision. Additionally, it features a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun that provides defensive capabilities against lighter threats. The tank's survivability in hostile environments is significantly enhanced by the Trophy Active Protection System, designed to intercept incoming anti-tank missiles and rockets. Equipped with a new-generation armor system that integrates both active and passive defenses, the Leopard 2A8 is engineered to withstand contemporary threats, including anti-tank guided missiles, ATGMs, and rocket-propelled grenades, RPGs. Despite weighing between 65 and 67 tons, the tank maintains impressive agility, achieving a top speed of 70 km per hour and a range of 450 km. It is also outfitted with advanced features tailored for extreme conditions, such as nuclear, radiological, biological and chemical NBC protection, enhanced thermal imaging, and an auxiliary power unit for extended operations. Primarily utilized by Germany and the Czech Republic, the Leopard 2A8 represents a vital asset for modern militaries, merging firepower, protection, and versatility to meet contemporary combat demands. The acquisition plan is part of a collaborative procurement initiative led by Germany, which invites Croatia to actively participate. According to available information, a comprehensive transaction model has been established. To offset part of the costs, Croatia plans to sell 30M-84 tanks and 30M-80 infantry fighting vehicles from its inventory. Following this sale, Germany will transfer these vehicles to Ukraine as part of ongoing military assistance efforts. Under the proposed agreement, Germany will financially compensate Croatia for the M-84 and M-80 vehicles effectively reducing the overall expenditure on the Leopard 2A8 tanks. This innovative approach aims to optimize available resources while simultaneously contributing to international support for Ukraine. For Croatia, this deal signifies a crucial step in modernizing its armored forces, enabling the replacement of older equipment with state-of-the-art technology. Currently, Croatia operates around 70 M-84 tanks, which form the backbone of its armored fleet. While these tanks are generally well-maintained, they do not compare to the capabilities offered by the latest generation Leopard 2A8S, which provides substantial enhancements in protection, firepower, and advanced electronic systems. The Leopard 2A8 features upgraded modular armor and sophisticated battlefield management systems, resulting in improved operational efficiency in modern combat scenarios. While the precise financial details of the acquisition and the delivery schedule for the Leopard 2A8 tanks remain undisclosed, the project stands as a strategic priority for Croatia. It aims to fortify its position within NATO and align with contemporary defense technology standards. The signing of the letter of intent signifies the beginning of formal negotiations with the manufacturer, with discussions on specific terms anticipated to continue in the upcoming months. The sale of the M84 and M80 vehicles to Germany, followed by their donation to Ukraine, aligns with the increasing support from Western nations for the Ukrainian military amid ongoing Russian aggression. This transfer seeks to enhance Ukraine's defense capabilities by providing battlefield-proven equipment, all while allowing Croatia to transition to a more modern armored vehicle fleet. This transition may also include specialized training for crews and maintenance personnel to effectively adapt to the new technologies. In summary, the agreement between Croatia and Germany not only strengthens the Croatian military's capabilities, but also reflects a broader commitment to regional security and international cooperation in the face of current geopolitical challenges.